I'd like to ask you a question. Are you 100% sure you're going to have a great retirement? Or do you have some doubts? What if I could show you how you can get out of debt in six to nine years, including the mortgage, without earning or spending any more than you are right now? We can show you how. According to the U.S. Census Bureau, the average American household will earn $2 million by retirement. Here's the problem. Most retirees only have $60,000 at retirement. And that includes the equity in the mortgage, by the way. This generation of Americans doesn't pay off their mortgages. We just refinance every seven years. Is that your American dream? If you're like the average American family, then for every $1,000 you make, your distribution looks something like this. And by the way, the ratios don't seem to change. It's the same percentages of distribution of that $1,000, whether that $1,000 is earned by a plumber or a doctor. Americans save only 3 to 4%. And for most of us, that doesn't end up in a savings account at the end of the month. It's in a government-sponsored, company-matching IRA or 401k. We live on about 23%. So $230 buys our toys, our food, and our fun. We spend about $400 on taxes for every thousand that we earn. So that's city, state, and federal. And here's the killer. We waste 34% or $340 of every thousand that we make on interest. It's gone, wasted forever it goes to the bankers. You'll remember, those are the same folks that we, the American taxpayers, bailed out a few years back with our tax money. Anyhow, that's another topic. As all of us know, interest does not buy us roads or schools. It's not protecting our country. It doesn't put food on our tables nor purchase our fun lifestyle. And it is definitely not putting a single penny toward our retirement. It is wasted forever. Here's how I think of it. I'm more visual. We spend Monday and Tuesday working to pay our taxes. We work all day Wednesday and almost all day Thursday to pay interest to the banks. Let's pause a second there. Nearly four days of every work week is spent earning money that goes to the government and the bankers. That leaves just over a day's worth of time spent buying our lifestyle. And we spend only about an hour every week towards savings. But we can help you change that. If you like the average American family that uses our program, our promise is this. You can pay off all your debts in six to nine years, including the mortgage. You'll save more money right now and for retirement. You'll increase what you can spend on lifestyle. You'll pay less on taxes. And best of all, quit wasting 34% of your hard-earned money on interest. And you can do all that with the exact same amount of money that you're currently making and spending today. Now we all know how banks work. All right, so let's say that we deposit $10,000 and they give us a 1% return on that money, if we're lucky. Then when we need the money and we go to borrow it back, they charge us what? Anywhere between three or 4% and 30%, depending on the kind of loan that it is. And if you're like I was, and you're thinking, yeah, well, my mortgage is in a very high interest rate. Think again. If you have a 4.5 annual percentage rate on a 30-year mortgage, the first five years, you pay over 71% in interest on every payment. Year six through 10, you're paying over 67%. And believe it or not, even in year 25, 52% is still going toward interest. Here's my question to you. What if you could become your own family bank and turn that interest you're currently paying to the bankers into your own profitable family bank? A bank that could become your family legacy. Regardless of what we do to make money, Again, whether you're a teacher or a pilot, doesn't matter. We all need to learn how to treat our own family as a business and learn basic business banking principles to guide our families. What we teach, in my opinion, is the most powerful financial tool on the planet. And it's simple, and we can show you how.
how you might ask? By refocusing our efforts on that which has the greatest financial impact. Think about it. Most people talk about the returns they get on the amount of savings that we're putting in. But we just saw how small that is. What would you consider a great annual return on investment for your long-term savings? Again, for most Americans, our money is tied up in a government-sponsored company matching IRA or 401k. And those might be getting, say, 7%. That's normal. But what if you could get 12%? That's above the average stock return. Would that be good? What if you could get 30%? That's twice the stock market. Or what if you could get all the way up to 50% return? That's four to five times the normal market returns. Again, working with that same $30 of every thousand that we put into savings, if we can make a 50% return in that 401k, every $30 we put in will make $15 more each year. That's 45 bucks. That is a great return. Now, Let's look at the effect of reducing the amount of interest we pay. Let's say we reduce our interest by only 10%. We're currently paying $340 in interest on every thousand that we earn. So 10% would save us $34 on every thousand. That's twice as much money in our pockets for reducing interest paid by only 10% as compared to increasing our rate of return up to 50% on the amount of our savings and investments. Is that making sense? But what if we could help you reduce the interest you pay by 15% or 30% or even 50%? If we can help you reduce the amount of interest you pay the banks by 50%, you now have an extra $170 in your pocket for every thousand that you earn without making any more money. So what has the greatest financial impact? You want $15 more on your savings and investments or $170 less on your interest? This is what sets our plan apart. Most financial advisors focus on the returns they can get us from the 3 to 5% we're putting in our savings and investments. And they're always trying to get us to squeeze a little bit more out. That's fine. But until we get rid of that 34% we waste on interest, all those investment gains pale in comparison to getting rid of interest. If you're like the average American family that joins our program within two to four years, for every thousand dollars you earn, your redistribution of that same thousand dollars will look something like this. 20% or $200 is now going to savings and investments. 23% or $230 is going to lifestyle. 40% is still going to taxes. Now really it'll be lower, but we'll just leave it at that for argument's sake. And only 17% is going toward interest or $170 of every thousand that you earn instead of the 340 that it used to be. Now, if that's all that we can do for you in the next two to four years, if that's the only thing that our program could do for you in the next two to four years, how would that change your life? And how would you feel? Let me introduce you to Erica and Scott. They have been married for about nine years now. They both had student loans before they got married and they now have a mortgage and a few children. They found this program six years ago. Look how it's helped them. Did you actually get to the point where you knew that you had succeeded in what this is supposed to do for you? Paying off that first debt. Just paying, paying off the that first, first debt. And knowing that we had cash too. You know what I uh -huh. mean? Paying off that first debt. And it was enough to go, okay, this is working. This is working. We didn't end up spending that money because something else came up. It just, it, and then there's never been a looking back since. So and what I, surprised you most about it? How quickly we were able to start paying debt, quite honestly. I thought this would take years. Oh, yeah, because you, well, you had a half million dollar nut. Yeah. No, but to be able to start, to be able to start paying off, even like a $500 credit card or a, mm -hmm. you know, to be able to just say, and we're done and we're done. And now we're building up that money that you were using for that one and this one, and it's making money for you. Okay. Now we're done with this thing and that thing. Like right. how quickly we've been able to, to, to tackle debt. But we don't stop with only 50% reduction in your interest. 
we actually wipe out all but 1% of your interest. That's what really happens in our program. So in six to nine years, for every thousand dollars you earn, your redistribution will look something like this. Now your savings will be about 29% or $290 of every thousand dollars that you earn. Lifestyle will have increased to about 40% or $400 of every thousand. Taxes will have decreased to about 30% or $300 of every thousand that you make. And interest is now only $10 of every thousand that you earned. That's the same thousand dollars. It's just redistributed differently. So let us build you a free, no obligation, customized financial roadmap. Here's the next steps. We need to gather some personal information. I'm not talking about your specific bank account numbers or anything like that. I'm talking about just the basic debts and basic income numbers for your household so that we can analyze your data, run some reports, and give you a personalized financial roadmap. And then we can get together, we can schedule a time when we can show you how you can get out of debt in six to nine 